The NCLEX competition is now over, and we received almost a hundred submissions from all around the world. We had submissions from people in nursing, dentistry, medicine, pharmacy, public health, and graduate studies in biological sciences. Here are a few clips from some of our winners. So this is a red blood cell that would be found uh, in a healthy adult. All right. If we look inside it, there are thousands of oxygen-carrying molecules called hemoglobin. So we have our four chambers of the heart. Remember that deoxygenated blood goes from the body to the heart, then to the lungs, and then oxygenated blood is pumped to the body by the left ventricle. In either case, they have impaired oxygenation of tissue. And so we're going to draw that in as cardiopulmonary disease inhibiting the oxygenation of tissue. Now let's say the left side of the heart fails. So when it does, blood is going to back up from the left side of the heart all the way back to the lung. Now what happens when blood backs up to the lung? Well, that means we have congestion in the lung. So afterload is the pressure that the left ventricle right here has to pump out against. And so that's this pressure here in the aorta that is basically opposing the blood coming from the left ventricle. Blood pressure. How do we know that? Because we looked at that handy dandy formula that was BP is equal to, you should be reciting this with me, uh, CO times PR. 